Hello, folks. Welcome back to the boat, and we're here playing Dark Souls Remastered Edition.、Uh, we're ready to tackle the Undead Bird plus the Taurus Demon in this episode. Oh, shit. As soon as we stepped out of there, he started jumping at us. Oh my god! There must be eagle to kill somebody.、Uh. You guys need to stop. We, you know, we don't get access to that yet.、Uh, oh, yeah, we could, we could definitely do this here. Let's head down. Yo, you guys need to chill. You don't want to fight these goons in a tight corridor here. Look at them; they can pose some decent threat in the early games. Some enemies here. Look at them. Get down. That's one. That's two. All right. Get out of here. I wish we could sprint run. Ah,、uh, we forgot the other loot that is in that room. There. <clears throat> Let's go back again. It should be right around the corner here. There we go. Now we need to take the same path that we took just a minute ago to go back to the top. Lost on the. This dragon here. Those are some sharp shooters. Shot us like a mile away. I can't believe we just got shot in the face.、Uh, we need to go stop him. Stop that gun. Light the bonfire here, just before we rest. 
Let's go speak to our merchant boy here. Oh. Eat this, okay. Before we step out of that door, look at this guy here. He's gonna go bonkers as soon as he sees you in the body of the room. Utilize your shields, it's always a good practice in the early games. Creepy. Seems that even treacherous in these times. A horrible ghost demon was moving below. And up above, there's a humongous threat. And the ball being in trouble. If you stick around this space, it might end up being your grave. <laughs> okay, so for the time being, let's buy the uh, residence key. And, okay, that's all we can buy. <laughs> Oh, yeah, uh, before we forget, oh, we can buy some arrows here. Yeah, let's buy 69 arrows. 69, yes. We're all spent. Um, we can rest here real quick and we can proceed through the level and kill off the uh, the dark knight training blows need to stop is he gonna run up here Yep, he is. Damn. Those pad things, though. He hopped over two corners plus one, a few stairs. In the early games, I wouldn't recommend you to fight multiple of them at once, or it could just end up ugly just like this. And when you're in, on your back foot, just retreat, take a chug, and you're ready to go again. Tactical retreat. Actually, oh, we could definitely consider kindling this bonfire here, because well, I'm planning on doing the uh uh Lodrian, uh, what's his name? Uh, Lo Lo Lodrian, the Car Karim Knight. So, if we decided to do his quest, the Firelink Shrine bonfire will be locked to us for a certain number of episodes. I'm not sure how many episodes that's gonna be, so, um, yeah, we, we might as well uh, kindle this one here, because it's probably the nearest bonfire that we can get. And let's walk up there and murder these three goons. That's where your pyromancy is really effective. And please stop that.
good size tag, but die please. Uh, we could drop down here. And we can take a look at what's ahead of us. I have the pillage in this chest. And backstab this good old guy. Okay, so... It might get a little tricky here because the Black Knight early games can really have some strong potential in one-shotting people. And even these guys hurt. Yeah. Ugh, I'm, I'm fighting the urge on feeding this guy a fireball. I would like to save that for the Black Knight here. We already used two fireballs. Okay, uh, go up here, run back, and we can bait this guy here so we can kill him. That way we, we got more space to run around without worrying that one of these guys gonna show up and just smack us. Uh, let's be slow and steady here. And backstab. Hello. And now you need to turn back and start running. We need to fight this guy not in a a uh, small closing place let's fight him here in this little square and backstab is your friend for this fight and your full time dodges Might have been that sentence. Okay. <laughs> well, that's a big cut. Uh, one more backstab. Okay, one last backstabs. Okay, that was not a backstab. There we go. If he drops us a weapon, oh, he drops us a shield. Uh, that's nice. And we can level up two more times. So for now, uh, let's go for a couple levels of, let's get the endurance up. Uh, or we can have, okay, so let's do two over there. Uh, yeah, let's just do on the endurance for now. Since we'll be not changing anything else, that three, that six, and we cannot wield it yet because we want 16 strength. 
Okay, so for for now, let's just stick with what we have here. Yeah, we have to fight these goons every time. Okay, that corpse disappears, so we'll never find out what's in there. Yeah, just be brave. Hold it with two hands and just whack them once and they're done. Okay. That's one, that's two. That's three. Quick turn around. Okay. This guy actually did some decent damage to us. Got three hits. Okay, that's it for him. And let's proceed to the Taurus Demon. That's a big thrust, my guy. Now you need to take that. Okay, after taking out those archers, uh, keep dual wielding, dual holding, or hold it with double hands. Run along until you see a big guy jumps down that tower. And keep running this way. Go up the ladder and we are going to do another drop drop kick. Yeah, let's call it drop kick from here on out. We are about to drop kick this guy. Another two. Down you go. Oh my god, the camera angles here. It just is so annoying. Humanity, homeward bounds. And did we have a bow? I wanna check. Uh, nope, we do not have any bows. Okay, so we're about to see the second NPC that we will be following the NPC quest line for. There is him. Of 
Yes. Yes, why not? Okay, so after talking to him, let's go activate the shortcut here. So what we are going to do here will be this way here. Oh no. I thought I was dead. Uh, okay. Let's do this real quick. And from here, take a turn back and kick down the ladder. That's our shortcut to our bonfire. But I'm going to do something a little different here. We, the By progression, you should be taking that path um, onto the top then but still you will be locked out but I want that bonfire right there so let's try to get that really wish that we have a bow or arrow or something okay uh yeah why not let, let, let's go buy a bow and arrow since we got the money here uh, I can show you guys how you could gain access to that bonfire at the very start of the game since we have taken care of this guy, so it will be a free run and we can buy the rest of the items on there. Just ignore them. But do murder this one here. He can be ra rather annoying if he shows up when you're talking to the other merchant. Okay, so they will not come down here. Okay, I just saw a strange glow. Purchase items. Uh, where is the short bow? Okay, we got the short bow. And repair box, bottomless box. Is there anything else that we need to buy? Okay, large arrows, a couple. All right. We're all spent again. So from here, let's head up the stairs, head up the ladder. So what we are going to do here is really simple. 
we are going to put an arrow on that dragon and he will be all pissed off start running at us uh, oh shoot that's just okay it, it doesn't matter that we don't have the stats for it I'll just put an arrow on him Oh, no, this is embarrassing. Um, okay, so... Okay, so you do that. And you run this way. Yeah, so the goal is... To shoot, shoot an arrow on the dragon, so he get all pissed off. And he flies down And you will just run past him And okay, so there is your bonfire here And we should have picked up the loot before we do anything, but okay Let's just do that real quick Claymore, so we'll probably ended up using the Claymore for the early episodes Until we gain access to that sword that I was talking about Okay, so um, Okay, so uh, Up ahead, it's going to be a brand new adventure and I would like to keep that one in a separate episode So let's wrap this one up here uh, in the next episode, we'll be proceeding through the rest of the Undead Burg up to the Undead Parish. Alright, so thank you for watching guys. Uh, I will see you guys in the next episode.